the next chapter which we have is the chapter of complex numbers now this is a chapter in which most of the students find some bit of difficulty but i'll say that if you apply all the concepts properly this is as easy as the chapter of real numbers the first problem which we have is we are given that a b c up to k are the roots of this equation and we need to prove that 1 plus a square into 1 plus b square up to 1 plus k square is equal to this thing now start starting with the fact that a b c up to k are the roots of this equation we can write it as x power n plus p1 into x power n minus 1 up to pn is equal to since these are the roots it can be written as x minus a x minus b x minus c up till x minus k since a b c up to k are the roots of this polynomial now putting x equals iota in this expression we will get iota power n plus p1 into iota power n minus 1 up till pn is equal to iota minus a iota minus b up till iota minus k. Now, in taking iota power n common from this entire expression, we get 1 plus p1 into iota power minus 1 plus p2 into iota power minus 2 up till pn into iota power minus n is equal to iota minus a iota minus b up till iota minus k. Now, we know that iota power minus 1 is equal to 1 upon iota is equal to minus iota iota power minus 2 is equal to 1 upon iota square which is equal to minus 1 iota power minus 3 is equal to 1 upon iota cube which is equal to iota and iota power minus 4 is equal to 1 so, putting all these values in the given left hand side expression, we will get iota power n into 1 minus p2 plus p4. This is the real part. Similarly, we have the imaginary part as minus iota times p3 minus p5 plus p7 and on taking minus 1 common from each of these brackets we will get minus 1 power n this becomes a minus iota b minus iota c minus iota up till k minus iota this we take as the first expression now in the original expression which was x power n plus p1 into x power n minus 1 up till pn is equal to x minus a x minus b up till x minus k initially we put x equals iota now we will put x equals minus iota so this becomes minus iota power n plus p1 into minus iota power n minus 1 up till pn is equal to minus iota minus a minus iota minus b up till minus iota minus k and on taking minus 1 sign common from each of these n brackets we will get minus 1 power n a plus iota b plus iota up till k plus iota Now, dealing with the left hand side of this expression, we will get on taking minus iota power n common from all these brackets, we will get minus iota power n 
इंटू वन माइनस पी वन पी टू प्लस पी फोर वी जस्ट नीड टू रिपीट द स्टेप्स एज वी डिड अर्लियर इन द केस ऑफ एक्स इक्वल्स आयोटा प्लस आयोटा टाइम्स पी थ्री माइनस पी फाइव प्लस पी सेवन इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन पार एन ए प्लस आयोटा b plus iota up till k plus iota this we mark as the second expression now very clearly if we multiply the expressions 1 and expression 2 what we'll get as this a minus iota into a plus iota this becomes a minus b into a plus b which is a square minus b square a square and iota square is minus 1 so this becomes a square minus minus 1 which is equal to a square plus 1 This becomes minus one part two n, which is equal to one. So this becomes the right hand side of the expression becomes a square plus one, b square plus one, c square plus one up till k square plus one. The right hand side will become a square plus one, b square plus one up till k square plus one. And the left hand side of the expression, this becomes iota bar n into iota bar. Into minus iota power n, when these two get multiplied, and here we have a plus iota b, and here we have a minus iota b, so this becomes a square minus iota square b square, which is a square plus b square. So this becomes one minus p two plus p four whole square plus p three minus p five plus p seven. Whole square. So, on equating the LHS and RHS, we get a square plus one into b square plus one up till k square plus one is equal to one minus p two plus p four whole square plus p three minus p five plus p seven going up till the last term whole square. And this was the desired result, which we needed to prove.